So let's move on to uh, the running back that the Browns have agreed to terms with, Naheem Himes. And he is coming off um, an ACL, LCL injury last year from a jet ski accident. 5'8", 198 pounds. Um, take us through this first clip and what you see with him here. No, he's a, he's a really good zone runner. He fits in what they do running well. But what he does really well is he catches the football at the backfield. And you're going to see a couple of hits. So I, I think he brings two things to the Browns. One is he can run the ball. He can run the zone. But what he really does well is he returns kicks. He returns punts. And he can catch the ball at the backfield. And this is just a zone run. He cuts it back. Browns run the same run. Most of the NFL teams do. Uh, he's a very hard runner. He's very good at pass protection. Uh, you know, he had 240 receptions as he comes to the Browns. So, you know, he only has 306 carries. So this is a typical third down back, but I really think he, he gives the Browns. Uh, this is kind of my first uh, breakdown on Hines. I was really impressed. He does a really nice job. All right. Um, you, you do mention um, his ability to come out of the backfield as a, as a receiver. Uh, 240 receptions, almost 1,800 yards, 1,718 and, and eight touchdowns. Uh, what do you see with him in this clip uh, relative to being a receiver? Well, this is just swing pass. So he understands, you know, when he's hot, when he's not hot. If they, you know, if the Browns run those where he's not in protection, but he's the hot route. But what, what you're going to see, the Browns are going to see, is you're going to see him split out. And he can do things that the Browns have not had it back. Green Hunt could do a little bit last year where he'd split out. But Hines can actually split out, split out and run receiver routes. He can run hitches and comebacks and curls and digs. So he'll actually split out and be an, an actual receiver, not just a check down guy, not just a, uh, a guy who's on swing routes. He can do those very well too, but he's a guy who can actually get in out there and, you, and, and Stefanski loves to go in empty uh, on certain downs and this guy can run routes out of empty, not just swings and check downs. So very, very good out of the backfield uh, is Hines. All right, uh, the other thing that um, we've had several questions on uh, this week, um, punt returner and kickoff returner. What do you see from him in the return game? Take us through this clip. Well, he's had, you know, he's had two touchdown kick returns and he's had two punt returns. And what you get out of him is you get vertical press right away. And when I was coaching, you know, and I learned from guys who, you know, know what they're doing as special teams, but returners have to get up field fast and then make a move. And that's what you see out of him. He catches the ball and gets vertical and then makes his move. And he's very explosive. Like I said, he has two return, kick returns, two punt returns. Uh, this is an area where the Browns have been very poor. And there haven't been many areas where the Browns haven't been very good. Their punt return yards and their kick return yards, but especially that punt return yards, because most of the time you're getting touchbacks in the NFL now, but they have got to improve this punt return game, and Hines can do that. If he comes back healthy, he will help the punt return game. 